All right, welcome back. The Nigerian army needs to be very careful before engaging the Eastern Security Network for these reasons. All right, the news in detail. More or less has been said about the Eastern Security Network, ESN, as some Nigerians have referred to them as good measures, while others have expressed concerns over their presence in the region, citing that it might bring about security threats in the region. Earlier, they made threats to any allegedly formed vigilante groups and security agencies who are planning on carrying out any attacks on them, adding that such acts will be met with consequences. They also explained that their recruits are allegedly from America, Asia, and Europe, hence they are very determined and dedicated to their cause. All right, the Nigerian army unofficially responded by allegedly planning on deploying several assets and surveillance resources to plunge the activities of the Eastern Security Network ESN. According to Sahara Reporter on its verified Twitter handle, he has said that exclusive at HQ Nigerian Army deploys aircraft gun trucks in search of Kano's Eastern Security Network camp. Sahara reporters in a video captured the Nigerian Army helicopters and their vehicles and soldiers searching for the camp of the ESN. All right, Eastern Security Network also uploaded a video showing a camp allegedly belonging to an unknown Fulani group burnt down in a move to achieve their objectives and others. All right, and then um, though the Nigerian army is very well equipped and robust in carrying out long range operations, but research has shown that new voluntary scattered and dynamic organizations can be one of the deadliest and dangerous to confront. Reasons why Nigerian army and military needs to be more careful in dealing with the Eastern Security Network. One, they are voluntary organization, hence they regard nobody. Two, their locations are unknown as they can be anywhere. Three, their resources are not identified yet to engage them in arms combat. For their recent activities and videos shows how bold they are and why the army needs to engage with caution. Five, they are new and very motivated with great hodge to carry out their objectives. Six, engaging the Eastern Security Network without a tangible reason may spark outrage and prompt security concerns in the region. Number seven, they are young, new, and their mode of engagement might not be conventional as the military will expect. Number eight, they are likely to have great sympathizers in the region hence their location might not easily be identified okay and then as it is what is your take on the rapid deployment of military forces to engage the esn without proper evaluation and to threat assessment okay all right talking about the Nigerian army, how the Nigerian army needs to be very careful before engaging the Eastern Security Network. Okay, and then a lot of people have reacted onto this, and then about 12 reasons have been mentioned so far onto this one, which the last reason uh, stated that 
they are likely to have great sympathizers in the region hence their location might not easily be identified all right okay and then as it is there's been a lot of reactions on this one and then according to sunday asia underscore zero two he has said that well nigerian government has not seen anything yet i know they are afraid of behalfrance but i will assure nigerians i will assure nigerian government that by the time me and my friends finish our studies in engineering field the federal republic of nigeria will see war equipment we behalfran engineers have already started carrying out serious scientific research work on the development of ballistic missiles we will burn down this country very soon serious war will escalate in this country very soon this is my promise and this is my happiness everybody watch it all right uh, according to sunday hezia underscore two he has been able to air his mind on to that hmm. okay well we are not praying for war in the country god help us anybody that is thinking of you no know, raising war should have a change of mind and then talking about burning the country that means you're trying to work work against even the innocent citizens of the country the thing is um, you need you all need to target the perpetrator the evil perpetrator of the act and then i think that would be a very good one instead of you no know, no affecting it making it to affect even the innocent ones well and um, i think that has been taken all right and then guess i said that we are behalf france by the name of jesus we shall conquer all right amen all right well guess i said on this one that well thank you for your analysis are you saying nigerian government should just fold their hands and watch a section of the country being taken over by her group this was the same hope that followed the declaration of Bihafra by the then eastern region governors that triggered the civil war hope you can recall the address of america president george w bush during the invasion of iraq where he said this is not going to be another vietnam and americans will not fight with their hands tied on their back they have beaten the drum of war and when it starts we pray to live to see the hand propaganda is a face of war so don't worry wait for it to start all right and then a lot of people have reacted onto this one well i guess i said that well it's most unfortunate that the nigerian military is making so much noise about esn when the same military has been mute on other similar developments in other areas this unprecedented action against the esn is actually proving the claims by the eastern correct beyond doubt that the north dies not see anything good from the east and needs to be done away with okay is that god's plans for the easterners no no weapon fraction against behalf france shall succeed further government leave behalf france alone as behalfra is of god hmm. well and um, that is it well the thing is times without number this had been said the eastern security network as far as a lot of no people are concerned they are of no evil they meant no evil so to say why because you no know, these people you are seeing they are fighting for the good of the land and that is how we see it simply because now you can see the so-called x-men the banditry kidnaps everywhere and nothing has been done by the federal government and how long are we going to wait for the federal government to profess security 
to Nigerian citizens, a lot of innocent souls are dying on a daily basis. And God has used Namde Kanum in this aspect, like to raise a security network that will protect the Biafran land. I don't think there is a big deal in that. Then why would the federal government now come to say that, oh no, we don't want this same security network. Uh, meanwhile, Amotekun is doing its work and a lot of people right now, as far as the eastern state is concerned, they are like, wow, this is a great testimony that since the emergence of the eastern security network, the people, the indigents of you know, the state, eastern states right now, can sleep with their two eyes closed. I think that is a very great achievement so far. Well, nobody is complaining. I don't know what, why the federal government is having a headache on this. Well, that is it, my people, on this one. Meanwhile, let me have your take on this one. And remember to subscribe for more updates if you have not done so. All right. Thanks and God bless.